More than 3,000 people are killed every year in car crashes involving distracted drivers. But distracted driving can mean many things. Tony explains in today's Behind the Wheel. After six years with the Tigard police, there's one thing Officer Travis Gregston still finds hard to believe. I don't ever really have to conceal myself on the side of the highway. I get I get vehicles that will that will literally pass me. Wow. Uh, and and they're so fixated on their phone uh, that they don't even see a uniformed police officer sitting there. If they're diverting their attention from driving, uh, yeah. that, that's distracting. Those distractions can be anything from eating behind the wheel to having a dog on your lap, but one distraction tops them all. Cell phone, cell yeah. phone use mainly. I could sit on, on side of the highway uh, and within a few minutes I've got somebody passing me on their cell phone. So it's constant. It's constant, yeah. In Oregon, distracted driving is a primary offense, meaning it can be the main or only reason a driver is pulled over. Oftentimes the, the phone is right in front of them, so either they're on speakerphone or actually looking uh, at the screen, or their head's down, right, so they're hiding the phone and so they're driving like this. Statistically speaking, most distracted drivers are between between the ages of 15 and 19. We respond to a number of crashes, right? And, and you know, it's really not one instance that sticks out for me uh, where cell phone use played a factor, right? It's the, to the totality. You know, it's the number of crashes we go to. For Officer Gregston, the message is clear. Just put the phone away, pull over safely, and, and take care of whatever you need to do. And then when you get on the road, just yeah. focus on driving. Tony Martinez, Fox 12 Oregon. And here's the thing, it's not just your life at risk, it's somebody else's. Absolutely. So you really have to pay Such attention. Such an important yeah, message. Really.